Our goal is definitely to, you know, improve every game, show, you know, everybody that what our, our culture is going to be, that our work ethic is going to be there day in and day out, going through that we're going to be a competitive program, you know, early on, um, going through to hopefully, you know, going into April, going into conference play, that we're starting to, you know, really come to form. A couple of players definitely are going to help us out right away. Um, Shelby Klotz, who is a transfer from Brevard uh, College, was their second leading scorer last year. Um, really looking for her to bring her Division II experience um, and stuff to the field, as well as Grayson Ringlover, um, who's a Michigan native, is a transfer from University of Indianapolis. Um, could also bring her Division II experience going through, as well as a few of our freshmen um, coming through with their club experience. Our three starting midfielders between uh, Shelby will be in that group as well as Grayson and then Savannah Stitch, uh, who was one of the club team captains on uh, the past. They'll come over and kind of create our core midfielders and they're going to be very, very vital for us. They'll be leaders both offensively and defensively, um, as well as t Savannah and Shelby are both captains for us. Uh, they bring really good leadership into the locker room and stuff as well, so they'll kind of be calming influences on the field. We bring Brianna Bangle in and Nat here for the spring, uh, who is also has some Division II experience at Brevard as well, and then played for Northern's club ice hockey team last year. Um, and so she, she's a very, very solid goaltender, comes out of Minnesota, um, really structurally sound, will be a great leader back there for us. And then we actually, um, the core group of our defense will actually be made up from girls from the club team. Uh, so they've experienced playing together. Uh, playing within a system, their communication is really strong as a group, uh, which will help us definitely go forth with, with a younger attack core. But they've actually made the job really easy. Um, they came in from day one wanting to really work hard, wanting to be coached. Um, they had experienced, you know, basically three of the players coached them for, for the past three years um, and did a great job getting the group organized. Um, and stuff and, and going to tournaments and stuff so they they really wanted to go to the next level of it uh, so they've made it extremely easy for for myself and our staff it makes it a little easier for us to come in as a new program and make a mark for ourselves whether it's you know winning a ton of games or being competitive in those games um, and so depending on our opponent I think you know teams are either in a rebuild or they're within their first five years of existence still so um, so a lot of games are kind of a 50-50 coin flip. Seeing, you know, how each program has started a little differently. Um, Adrian, we started out really fast. Um, going to Kalamazoo as the head, it took a little longer. Um, didn't have quite as much instant success. Um, so learning, you know, to be patient with it, that every team's going to be a little different.